Many of you know that the last seven years have been quite a challenge for our little family. Our first son, Jackson, was born with a cleft lip and palate and has been through seven surgeries since he was born. And we have three surgeries in his future. What I have learned from Jackson through all of this is that no matter what adversity comes your way, you can overcome it and you can get through it. He is my hero. In addition, he was also diagnosed at age three with sensory processing disorder. At age four, he was diagnosed with ADHD. And at age five, he was diagnosed with anxiety. All of these things make normal everyday activities difficult, such as going to the store, fireworks or holiday events, vacations, going through the car wash, or sirens going by, putting on jeans or uncomfortable clothes, and sleeping, and taking naps. We stay busy by doing things that he enjoys, like sensory integration play, reading about anything that you can learn about science and social studies, building things, crafting, and going on many trips. We are working on building a sensory room for Jackson so he has a place to go when he is overwhelmed or overstimulated and a place in which he can get his sensory integration therapy, some extra physical therapy activities, extra speech activities, and extra occupational therapy activities in addition to giving him a safe place to play. Join us as we create this space and give you ideas about ways that you can create sensory activities, bins, toys, walls, and many different things associated with ADHD, sensory processing disorder, ODD, which is oppositional defiant disorder, and anxiety. Jackson has one thing left to say. Like and subscribe to our channel.